This is a video demonstration for how to customize the RegCure Pro scan settings to your preferences. You're going to see a screen something like this after the scan finishes that has your scan results. On this particular machine, I've intentionally added some problems to it just so that I have something to show you. So next to each scan category, there is an edit link. If you click on that edit link, it'll show you more information about what exactly it found, and it'll show you the items that it's planning to remove. Anything with a checkbox in it is something that it's planning on taking care of. For example, in the malware section, under the threats category, there's actually a piece of software which installs conduit on your system when you run it. The malware scan found that, knows that it's not good, so it's going to remove it. In the registry section, you have a listing for each registry entry that it's planning on removing. Any registry entries that are, say, invalid or point to an invalid shortcut, that kind of thing. And there are similar listings available for the privacy and the junk file sections as well. It's pretty much more of the same, so I won't bother going through all of them, but it'll show you the programs and the files that it's planning on clearing out. So when you click on Fix All, then it'll start cleaning out the items. In my particular case, I've cut it out just to save about a minute or so off the length of this video, but you can see that in total it took about a minute and a half to finish cleaning in my case. There is, of course, the Stop Scan button if you want to interrupt it at any point. When it finishes, it'll ask you to reboot the computer. So when your computer starts back up, it'll probably go through the update again. It'll check to see if there's any updates for the program and install. Usually it doesn't take long even if there is an update available. And if you check that box in the corner, it'll automatically close the window when the update is finished, and it'll bring you back to the home screen of RegCure Pro. Depending on your settings here, it may start scanning again automatically. If you've just done a scan, there's no need, so you can go ahead and stop the scan. Each section of the scan has a checkbox that you can uncheck if you don't feel like running that particular section. Do note, however, that the malware and the system performance sections can only be run both at the same time. You can't have one of them without the other. So if you uncheck the box and then start a scan, then it's going to skip that particular part of the scan. And of course, anything that does have a checkbox in it is going to be scanned. Now there is a maintenance button on the left side. If you click on that, then it brings you to the scheduling system for the automated scanning. As you can see, on the right side, there is a setting for when or how often to scan each part of the scan. It also adds a section that's not part of the default scan, which is the defrag scan. We don't recommend running a defrag more often than, say, once a month or so, so it's excluded from the default scan. And then, of course, there's the button in the bottom left, the checkbox that says automatically start fixing items after the scan, which means that instead of just scanning, it'll also fix. And there's a customize link in the bottom right, which will let you set more detailed settings for how the schedule works. So usually you can set it to just run the scan in the middle of the night so it doesn't get in your way, although do note that the computer has to be running at the scheduled time in order for the scan to run. So you can click on Save to change your settings, or you can just close it if you want to give up on your settings. And of course there's the Reset Defaults button in the bottom right. If you click on that, then it'll set everything back the way we recommend it. As always, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact our support department or have a look at the other videos in this series.